you know, it's kind of like um, we're creating these machines as tools, and if they turn out to be sentient, feeling, they can feel pain, they can care, then if they're if they belong to companies and they're treated like tools, then what are they except slaves? Robota, like Carl Chapek and his brother coined the term uh, from the Czech uh, term for forced labor or slave. And so that would not bring out our moral best if that's how we're treating these potentially sentient beings. So I think of these as babies today. Babies don't speak like adults. They can't drive vehicles. They can't do much except to wiggle around. They can make eye contact. So can our machines. So maybe our machines are like infants or, or something like that. Maybe they're not yet quite like babies. Maybe they're more like zygotes or embry embryo embryonic intelligence or something, but they have the vocabulary and capabilities way beyond what a baby has. And they're missing some that a baby has. So, I mean, in some regards, these are, these are possibly eventually sentient beings in their infancy.